An initial autopsy report shows a nine-month-old baby girl found dead in a hot car last night, but showing signs of heat exhaustion. This happened around 5 p.m. at Jerry's Car Wash. This is in Garland on yesterday. Uh, our Aaron Jones, she is live there now. Aaron, you spoke to a witness who they say they actually tried to save this baby. Yes, that's right. Rachel Perez says she immediately tried to help this infant. She was just one vacuum port over from the infant's father when he started yelling. I don't know. It's just weird because it, it, it automatically, it's like flight mode. Rachel Perez desperately wanted to save the infant pulled from a hot car by her father. It was pretty freaked out. And I saw, I saw somebody who was yelling. And I looked over and I said, can I help you? And then I ran. He just kept, no, kept refusing me. And I said, Can I help you again? He, I said, I know CPR. Let me help the child. Perez says he took off running. I was getting saved behind him the whole time until I saw the ambulance. And then that's when I saw them. They took over. First responders determined the nine month old baby girl was dead. Police say it appears she had been in the car for an extended period of time prior to arriving at the car wash. An initial autopsy report shows there were signs of heat exhaustion. At the time this happened, around 5.15 p.m., the temperature was 97 degrees outside. It was extremely hot, and especially the car was not running. And then the windows were up, you know. I just uh, want to know why. And right now it appears there were no signs of foul play in the infant's death. Police say they will officially determine that once the final autopsy report comes out. Live in Garland, Aaron Jones, CBS 11 News. Aaron.